the pop-up metaverse workflow begins by using a LiDAR-equipped iPhone or iPad to quickly scan and create a 3D model of a local environment. This scan becomes the baseline for a pop-up metaverse session, in which remote users can view the environment in a web browser and collaborate with local users who join via an AR iOS application. The remote expert can see the position of the local user as well as their video stream. They can watch this video directly or see how it is positioned within the larger context of the 3D environment. This is a real-time, multi-user, web-based collaborative system. The remote expert can guide the local user through the space using a virtual pointer. The local user can follow this pointer, seen through their AR device, to navigate through a complex environment and check problematic areas, such as verifying a sensor reading. The remote expert may have documentation of a necessary repair procedure, which they can drag and drop into the metaverse to contextualize it within the 3D space and send the file to the local user in a remote assistance scenario. In addition to remote assistance, the pop-up metaverse can be used for capturing and analyzing human motion. When the human motion recorder is activated, a person's pose is tracked and visualized in the 3D scene and color-coded with a real-time ergonomics analysis. The expert can remotely record the repair process. The iPad recording this data can be held by another worker on site or mounted on a tripod. When the work is done and the stop button is pressed, the data appears on a timeline and mapped into the 3D space. The expert can scroll through this data and segment it into steps to calculate the standard work time of each step and get more granular ergonomics insights. In this case, the expert sees wasted time and motion spent walking to the opposite side of the machine to pick up a tool. Due to the multitasking nature of this system, a spatial measurement application can be activated while still viewing the motion paths, and the expert can measure the distance from the work area to two possible locations that the tool table can be relocated to. They activate another application, a drawing app, and mark a rough rectangle on the floor where they envision the table can be placed. Other remote experts can collaboratively see these updates and discuss changes to the space, toggling between any of the available digital tools, such as annotations, measurements, PDF documents, and the motion analytics, to better inform their decisions and communicate effectively with others remotely, all while leaving a permanent digital trail of their discussion that can be revisited later. One expert decides to embed a CAD model into the space to try to better visualize how a table might look in the proposed location. To do so, they drop in an OnShape application, log in with their secure credentials, and browse their documents for the particular table. They can drag this table into the exact location that they prefer, and workers on site can preview this in the real space in AR. Upon deciding that this is the right course of action, they document this decision with a digital note so that future viewers of this metaverse session can view and respond to the decision. Now we demonstrate the spatial analytics feature, which identifies real-time physical changes in the environment. Objects that have been removed from the space are distinctly visualized in red, while newly added objects are highlighted in green, providing a clear and immediate understanding of environmental alterations. We can also explore spatial map analysis for height and gradient visualization and experience engaging text-based interactions with an embedded chat GPT functionality. Finally, we utilize state-of-the-art 3D visualizations through Gaussian splatting, where we enhance a photorealistic rendering on top of the conventional mesh model. This alternative visualization mode is exemplified in a detailed demonstration featuring furniture, showcasing intricate 3D views and precise measurements.